what started off as a normal working day for Ruth George, who was only employed there for about two months, turned out to be a nightmare. George, who originally hails from Kavango West, was pleased to be gainfully employed as a sales assistant after months of searching for work, even though she only earned close to $1,000. On Saturday, a customer ordered a floral material, but halfway through cutting the required measurements, the customer walked off without cancelling her order. This action made her Chinese employer infuriated. What followed left the young woman stunned. The customer, he disappeared. I have nowhere to find it. Then he said, how, how, how can you cut while the customer is not? I mean, no, the customer was there. It's that my colleagues, McKenna, who was talking to me. That's why the customer, I did not even see where the customer went in the shop. There were a lot of people. Then he said, no, you cannot cut the material like that. How many meters did you cut? I said, three, three meters. I said, no, you need to pay it. Then I said, how can I pay the material? I don't have money right now. If you want me to pay it, unless I'll pay it end month. Or either I'll just sell it. Because we normally do, if you cut the material wrong, or you cut for the customer and the customer did not buy the material, you make sure to, to sell it before end month. She says her employer, only known as Lee, was furious and called the police, who failed to show up. Lee, who runs the shop with his wife, then angrily requested George to remove the uniform she wore provided by them and told her to cover herself with a box. The secret said no. For law of Namibia, it's not permitted for you to, 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 to give someone a box to wear. Just leave her to go. Then she will just come back and bring the uniform, or she will just give it to the friend, as, as, as she said, no. And she said, no, she must remove Then she said, no, unless you must give her something to wear, which she will wear. After that, then the way by the say that he went and took this. Whereby he took this certain material, one meter to give me that, wear this one and remove my uniform. The time I removed the uniform, it was public in the, in, in the, in, in the shop. Why did you remove? He just told me that God and remove. Since George was scared, she went ahead and complied and undressed in full view of customers, leaving her only in her bra and her panties. They later gave her a certain material to cover herself. She went to the police, but when they came back to confront him, he was nowhere to be found. NBC's efforts to get hold of the store owner proved futile as the phone went unanswered. The police deputy commissioner Kauna Shikwambi confirmed that a case of assault through threatening and indecent assault was opened. Evelyn Paulus, NBC News, Venduk.